Hi friends! It's that really fun time of year when spooky ghosts and goblins and witches and mummies appear. Today we're going to make a really fun project for Halloween and what we're going to make is this cute mummy. So for this mummy, let's talk about what shapes we see. What shape is the paper plate that we use? If you said a circle, you're right. What shape are the eyes of this mummy? You're right, there's two more circles for the eyes. And then the rest of this mummy has some interesting shapes to make the, the black part, this black part around the eyes. We're gonna start with this shape of paper. What shape is this black piece of paper? If you said rectangle, you're right. It's a rectangle. We're gonna tear it a little bit up so it's gonna be a jaggedy rectangle. So we're gonna lose that, lots of fun shapes. And there's, I see some more shapes on his teeth. What shapes are some of his teeth? Like this one and this one. Right, they're squares. So we're gonna use lots of different shapes to make our mummy. Let's get to it, friends. Okay, friends. To make your mummy, you're going to need a paper plate and some eyes. I cut out these already for you. There's light orange, green, or dark orange that you can choose from. You need some little circles for the eyes. And you're gonna need a black piece of paper that's in the shape of a rectangle. And you can use a marker or a black crayon. And you're gonna need a glue stick. So the first thing you want to do is draw the mouth of your mummy. We're gonna draw that first. So whatever shape you want the mouth to be. If you want him to be smiling, if you want him to be mad or sad, you can make any kind of shape of mouth and draw some teeth, but the teeth are broken and old because he's an old mummy that's been in the grave for a long time. So I'm making some jagged teeth on him. And then in between the teeth, I'm gonna draw this black where it's the inside of his mouth. You can make some of his teeth have cracks in them if you want, because he has been in the grave for a long time. Or if you don't even want to make teeth, you don't have to. All right, the next thing you're gonna do is we're just gonna make some stripes where his bandages are. So you start on one side of your plate and you just draw lines across. Don't draw over the mouth, draw around the mouth. However you wanna do it, just make lines. You can make some go down and some go across. you get your lines drawn you just take your black rectangle and you're going we're going to rip the edges so it's all jaggedy and bumpy so you just rip some pieces off and I'm gonna glue this on this is like a hole in his bandages where his eyes are showing and it's black back behind there So put lots of glue on there. Then glue it right up here towards the top of your plate. And then all you need is the eyes. And I'm gonna choose two dark orange eyes. Put some glue on your eyes. One, because he's peeking through his bandages where they got a hole in him. Or 
Or you can put the glue on here if it's easier. The black paper. And there he has his eyes. Now all he needs is some circles in the middle of his eyes. Or wherever you want to put him. You can put him up by the top if you want. Whichever way you want him to be looking. Okay, friends. There's our friendly little mummy. I think he's looking pretty good. When you're done with your mummy, don't forget to put your name on him or her. You can write it on the back. Then you can take your mummy home and have a happy Halloween with your spooky mummy. See you next time.